Hey guys, what's up? Scarlet got to go here today. I'm going to give you a review. Not a movie, but a TV show. The Fall. Starring Jamie Doran and Gillian Anderson. If you do not know Jamie Doran, he is from Fifty Shades. He was in Once Upon a Time as Sheriff Graham. And, of course, Gillian Anderson is from... Uh, Ah uh, yes, the X Files. So if you have not seen this show, you're really missing out. Cause if you like drama and suspense, this is the show for you. Now it's not really from like the United States when it came out, but that was like what five years ago, and then not five, six years ago. Because this show was technically on BBC Two, so we had BBC One, which is like you know American, but BBC Two was technically for like the UK area, so like London. So this show is basically about like I'll do it quick. Okay, DSI Stel Gibson is a heart pounding psychiatrist. Called to Belfast to investigate a high profile murder. Gibson quickly realizes that the serial killer prowls the city. The culprit is named Paul Spector, who Jamie plays. Now, he, you know how Jamie is. He's a hot Hong Kong guy. So, in this show, um, you can tell right away that Jamie is the killer. But, anyway, my review on this show is 5 out of 5 stars. It's really good. I don't want to spoil anything, but Jesus. Anyway, this guy, he's just like sick minded fuck. So he does take panties and underwear. What? That's the same thing. And bra. He also clips hair of his victims. Not going to say anything more because I don't want to spoil anything. But anyway, this is like a. Thriller, sus suspense. It's yeah. I got the whole collection uh, for Christmas. There, yes. There's only downfall for the show. Um, there's only 18 episodes total. So five for season one, six for season two, and six episodes for season three. But for London, they call them series. But the good fall about this. There's a downfall, and there's a good fall. I told you the downfall, not that many episodes. The good thing about this show is that, yeah, there's only 18 episodes total. But what makes me have, like, five stars is because each episode is, like, an hour long. So if you watch one episode, it's kind of like a, feels like you're watching a little mini movie. It's an hour and one minute long per episode, so technically that would mean 18 hours. So even so, even if there was commercials in London, it would show that the TV show is like maybe two hours long. But since London doesn't really do commercials, um, I think it would stay for an hour. But you know how Game of Thrones or um, never seen it, or like, you know, Once Upon a Time, they say it's an hour long on TV, because, you know, like, about 15 minutes for, um, commercial time, but this show, this show is different, right here, this show is really different, because each episode, like I said before, is an hour long, so, an hour one minute, so, five episodes, that would take you about f five hours to five hours to finish one season, which is pretty good. Cause that would be like, for example, I don't know. So it's like about you know if you're watching like, oh Jesus, it's like if you had like twenty episodes of a twenty minute show, and that's about five hours I think I don't know my brain is loopy I don't want to do the math but yeah that's what the good thing about this show is like 
they're like an hour long, which is like amazing, because, yeah, there's only three series, aka three seasons, and people be like, uh, well, there's only five episodes in season one, six in season two and three. I'm not going to watch that. That's not long. Well, like I said before, it's worth it, because I know I told you the downfall, but it makes it better, because the episodes are like an hour long so it's like you're watching a movie in two parts and it's really good like after you watch one episode you can't put it down you wouldn't be able to put it down you'd be like I need to know what happens next um but yeah technically it also has this guy in it he's from Merlin right here I don't know if I showed him, but he's right there. I don't know if you're seeing him, but he's right there. But it's a good show. Like like I said before, it's an hour long per episode. So in total, it'd be like 18 hours worth of the nice, nice show. But yeah, that's why I give it five stars. If it was like maybe only 45 minutes... Like how some shows are an hour because 15 minutes of commercial time between you're watching free TV. This is actually like an hour long. Now, um, another reason to watch is like it's amazing. The acting is great. Like for Jamie's character as Paul, you could, it's like, Jesus, is Jamie a killer now? Because from watching this it really grips your I don't know what the word is but it really grips into your soul and it's really good like the acting is just phenomenal not just for Jamie but for Gillian Anderson as well and for like some of the small major roles for the other actors but if you like electric suspense like it says for entertainment weekly it says electric with suspense uh, this shows really good um, good for you plus um, as you see here uh, you see four to five episodes and then there's um, episodes um, four to six but yeah there's like six episodes like I said for season two and three but five for season one but it's like the greatest show you've ever seen um if you do buy it go on amazon for a com com complete i um i heard this was like 30 because it was like on sale but make sure you read the description because if you if it's nothing major then okay buy it because but do read the description because um, you know, it's from London, and not all London discs work on most DVD players from, like, the U.S., so I don't, that's why it's important, but if you don't want to really pay, it is on Netflix, apparently it is on Netflix, if you want to watch it, just search The Fall, and look for Jamie Doran starring in it, and Gillen Anderson, but like I said before, this show is just phenomenal. Um, I've seen it before, like, like a year when the first season came out, and of course watched the other one, and then of course you had to wait like two years until the third season came. But it's totally worth it. It's heart pounding. It's like it really makes you want to continue, but. And I said, downfall, only 18 episodes total. Good point of this show is because the shows are, the episodes are an hour long each. So it's really, really worth a watch. Um, but yeah, very talented acting, especially for Jamie and for Gillian, but mostly important for um, Jamie because he gets you those feels. And... You may think he got known for Fifty Shades, but he didn't. He really got more of his boost for the fall. Yeah, he got extra boost for 50 movies, but mainly he 
got more recognition for this, from my opinion. But, like I said, that's my review for the fall. If you guys want to buy it, check it out on Amazon. Be careful you read the description, because not all discs work for the DVD players in the U.S. Or, if you want, watch it on Netflix. I don't know if it's still on Netflix. If not, I'm really sorry about that. Um, but I'm sure you can find ways, because I know I found ways to watch it online. But... If you haven't, go watch it. If you have watched it, um, tell me your opinions. I would love to hear your opinions on the show. But, yeah, that's my review for The Fall. Starring Gillian Anderson from The X-Files and Jamie Dorn that was originally from Fifty Shades and Once Upon a Time. But, if you were watching this, thank you. Give this a thumbs up. Give it a comment and comment below but yeah thank you for watching my review i'm scarlet gothical see you next time